Hello everyone, I welcome you all to the Infinite Division platform. Right now I'll be doing one such question that came in your JMIN examination. This question came on 1st September 2021 and this question came on shift 2. So the question says a student determined the Young's modulus Y which is also given to you. Okay, and in the terms of MG, LQ, 4B, DQ and Delta is also given to you. The expression is already given to you. Uh, the value of G is taken to be 9.8 so the value of G is constant. So without any significant error and G doesn't have any error. This observation are full uh, and their obser his observation are following which is given to you. Then the fractional error in the measurement of Y. So the Young's modulus may kitna error aega wo nikana hai aapko. Yeah, so we already know that Y is given by the expression MG L cube divided by 4B T cube and delta. So how we can uh, find out the fractional error in uh, fractional error in Young's modulus that is given by the relationship delta y divided by y must be equal to delta m divided by m. This is how you can find out the fractional error in uh, any particular um, uh, any particular variable which is related to some other variables plus because since g is constant so the error in it would be an error is also zero in it okay and g is also a constant so we need not write the value uh, the expression of g so we can easily write the expression of others which is 3 delta l by l this is how you write the expressions plus delta b by b plus 3 delta d by d plus delta delta divided by this delta. So what are these delta y and what are these delta m and delta l, delta b and delta d and delta d. So the error in the mass is 1 gram. That is also the least count of the value because the least count is classified as the least value that you can measure and that is also equivalent to your error in that measurement. So the error in the measurement of the mass is 1 gram. Okay, so you can easily write it as delta y by y. You can easily write it as delta m by m. So delta m is, if you converted it into kg, it would be equivalent to 0 0.01. So 0 0.001 divided by 2 kg. Plus 3, error in length, which is 1 millimeter. Okay, and length is... 1 meter. So the error in length delta L comes out to be 1 millimeter which is nothing but 10 raised to the power minus 3. Because you have to uh, make sure these errors must be in the terms of the real values. Okay and further we will solve the ex expression again. What else we need to write now? Plus delta B by B. So error in breadth is 0.1 mm okay 0.1 mm 1 millimeter has got 10 raised to power minus 1 centimeter so it would be equal to 4 over here because 4 is the real value of the breadth okay plus 3 times of delta d by d so delta d is 0 0.01 milli again millimeter has to be converted into centimeter so you have to write it as minus 1 over here. So 3 into 0 0.01 into 10 to the power minus 1 divided by 0 0.4 centimeter. Okay, plus last value which is delta L by delta. So delta is nothing but depressions. Okay, depressions error is given as 0 0.01 mm. So write it at 0 0.01 mm. Again, you need not convert it into centimeter because it is uh, the actual value is already given in millimeter so it will remain like this divided by 5 so solve this expression you can get the value of fractional error in the Young's modulus and it will come out to be 0 0.0155 so that means second is your correct option that you need to get I hope this question is clear to everyone thank you